Hi everyone, this is Vishwajit. Welcome back again with another video. In previous video, we have discussed about how we can use if else statement in Python. And in this video, we will learn about how we can use elif statement in Python. Now I am inside my VS code and I will create a file here. So for that, I will click here and I will give the name as tutorial. 24 underscore l if dot py and then hit enter then you can see the file is created so imagine if you have multiple conditions and depending upon that condition you want to run multiple block of code okay so that is if you have n number of condition if the first condition is true then you want to run some particular block of code and if the second condition is true then you want to run another block of code and uh, if the third condition is true then you want to run some another block of code and so on and so forth so in that scenario elif statement comes into the picture so let's take an example uh, we will write a program here where we will ask user to enter its mark and depending upon that mark we will print the grade okay so let's imagine if uh, the mark is uh, in between 90 to 100 then we will print O grade. Okay. We will print O grade. And uh, if the mark is in between 90, uh, sorry, if the mark is in between 80 to 90, then we will print E grade. And uh, if the mark is in between 70 to 80, then we will print A grade. And uh, if the mark is uh, 60, to 70 then we will print a b grade and if the mark is less than uh, less than 60 then we will print c grade so let's write this program uh, i will create a variable here so the variable name is let's say mark and uh, i will take input from user so for that i will write here uh, input function and inside input function i will write a message enter uh, your percentage mark okay enter your percentage mark and uh, now i will check if this mark is greater than equals to 90 then i will print here print o grade okay o o grade so now you can see as it is input function it will convert the input value into a string so that's why i will uh, wrap up this input function inside int function okay so for that i'll write int and inside int function i will write input okay so now if this condition is true then it will print o grade okay so now if this condition is false then i want to check another condition okay so for that i will write here l if and the condition is if the uh, mark is less than 90 and the mark is greater than equals to 80 okay so the mark is greater than equals to uh, i'll write here 80 then i want to print uh, i want to print e grade okay e e grade okay so similarly i can write another condition also l if uh, the mark is in between uh, 70 to 80 that is less than 80 and uh, uh, the mark is greater than equals to 70 and i will print here if this condition is true i will print i will print a grade okay a grade and uh, if uh, now i will write another condition l if uh, if the mark is uh, less than 70 and uh, if the mark is greater than equals to 60 uh, then i will print here print b grade okay b grade so now at at last i just need to write here else okay else in other scenario i will print c grade okay c grade so now observe it carefully if uh, first if this condition is true okay if this first condition is true then it will print this statement okay 
and if this condition is false then it will check this second condition okay if this second condition is true then it will print this statement now if this second condition is false then it will check the third condition okay if the third condition is true then it will execute whatever written inside the third condition okay and if this third condition is false then it will execute the fourth condition and if the fourth condition is true then it will print the uh, block of statement which is written in under the fourth condition and if this fourth condition is also false then it will enter into the else part in and it will print c grade okay so in this way this l if statement works in python so now if i run this file then you can see the result uh, i'll run the file here and uh, let me show you if i enter here 96 and then hit enter then you can see it is printing o grade okay so if i again run this file and i will give here suppose 85 and then hit enter then you can see it is printing e grade okay and uh, now if i again run this file and i will give the mark as uh, 74 and then uh, hit enter then you can see it is printing a grade okay so now let me clear the terminal and uh, if i again this uh, run this file then if i give here suppose 46 and hit enter then you can see it is printing c grade okay so in this way this l if statement works in python so this is it for now we will continue from this onwards in our next video thank you for watching this video